How's it going, guys? I'm Connor from Running Warehouse. I'm here with Lauren, footwear merchandiser at ASICS. Today, we are going to be taking a first look at the new ASICS Fuji Light 4. Now, Lauren, the Fuji Light series has always been known as light, nimble, on the trails. Now, we've got a completely new update with version 4. Can you tell us about the inspiration of this shoe and what it's all about? For sure. So Fuji Light 4, light, fast, nimble, that's what it's all about, as you said. Um, and that's exactly the reason why a lot of our European trail runners choose this shoe for a lot of their races because it's light, it's fast, um, and it's really responsive underfoot. Yeah, and like I said, we've got a complete overhaul from top to bottom, and I think the first part we got to start with this shoe is the midsole. And Lauren, we got the Flight Foam Blast upgrade. Tell us about it. Yeah, uh, Flight Foam Blast, we're adding it here, uh, moving from Flight Foam on the previous version, the Fuji Light 3. Um, so a nice update here. It's gonna be a little bit more responsive, a little bit softer, and a little bit more energetic underfoot. And we've seen the Blast Plus on the trail side with shoes like the Tribuco Max, where you get a large amount of stack height underfoot, really good for some of those long ultra marathon type distances. Mm -hmm. But when you look here, this is gonna be a little bit lower to the ground. Again, that more nimble experience can you tell us what you might want to use this for in terms of terrain? Absolutely. Um, so really versatile shoe here. So a lot of options. Um, someone looking to take this out on rugged terrain, having that sort of low to the ground, a little bit uh, more nimble experience, as you said, uh, this is going to be a great option. Yeah, you know, I do feel like with the stack we see here, you are going to have that very connected to the ground experience. And you talk about rugged terrain. We got to talk about the outsole. We've got a new outsole lug layout, and it looks pretty sticky. For sure. Uh, so the ASICS grip outsole, we're sticking with that compound. We know it works. We're super confident with it. But we have updated the lug design a little bit. And what this is going to allow is that it's lightening up the shoe a little bit, but it is also going to make it a little bit more uh, improving traction. Yeah, small progressions to get that little bit more bite. And again, yeah. at a lighter weight, you can't complain. Now, moving on up to the upper, wrapping the shoe together, we've got a new design and taking a look, it's got a very fast aesthetic. Tell us about the upper. Yeah, an updated engineered mesh up your here. It's gonna be nice and breathable, but you're gonna still have protection in areas like on the toe. Yeah, and just feeling it, you do have a fairly thin design, but there is that little bit of extra uh, material to get that protection and also the nice amount of support to go some of those longer distances. I think this will have that versatility to be fast for maybe a short race, but also have that reliable feel to maybe take for some of those longer distance races. Yeah, absolutely. And I think given the price point at $130, the the versatility here is is really incredible. Yeah, you know, I think the ASICS Fuji Light 4 makes small progressions over that last version, really taking everything you loved about it, that fast, nimble feel, but just modernizing it for 2023. If you're looking to get this show on your feet, when can you have it? Summer 2023. You can find it here at Running Warehouse.